Yeah. Your car could go round these. Well, like a track. Yeah. So, so they could go down. So it could go down here. Loop, 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 loop. Up that hill. Oh, it's all nice and warm in here again, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> you look cool. <laughs> you look cool, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, now the kids are dropped off at school, I get a chance to enjoy the day on my own, which is um a little bit odd today because today it's my 40th birthday and um, uh, we've done several things in the previous few days, uh, family things, we've had a lovely time doing bits and pieces together, we've got more planned for next weekend but for today everyone's at school and work and um, I'm home alone. So uh, I am going to go to the gym again this morning because uh, why not, I enjoy it uh, but then I think the rest of the day is probably going to be taken up with um, drinking coffee, wandering around, uh, just generally trying to have a relaxing sort of day. So um, that's the plan for today. Uh, as far as what I'm going to talk about today, um, I actually don't know. Uh, this is I think the first time I've done this. Uh, because we've been doing so many things over the last few days, I haven't had a chance to really plan or work out what I want to talk about today. So. Uh, Let's see what, what turns up, let's see what happens. I'm sure there'll be something interesting to talk about during the course of the day. But for now, the sun's shining, I'm heading to the gym, and oh, presents. The best present, or the, the main present I got um, today was uh, from Sarah and the kids. They've bought me uh, a track experience to drive a BMW i8 around a track. Uh, don't know what I'm gonna do it yet, we've gotta organize it all, but um, I'm very excited about it. I've wanted to drive one for a very, very long time, so um, yeah. Hopefully that will be a, a brilliant day out and hopefully we'll be able to get some film of it as well. But um, yeah, I can't wait for that. Well, I was hoping going to the gym yesterday and today would blow this cold out of me, but um, it hasn't. Actually, today was really, really hard. Um, we were outside, sun shining, so it was lovely. But um, yeah, I found it quite difficult today. But while I was exercising, I got to thinking uh, about kind of how I've ended up where I am now. And um, the fact that, you know, 40 years have gone by how did I get to where where I am you know I feel that I'm quite fortunate I'm very happy in life I've got an amazing family um, you know things are really really good for me but I haven't planned any of that I haven't ever you know some people sit down don't they and they work out uh, a life plan a five-year plan a ten-year plan I've never ever done it I've just kind of taken each day as it comes what I really need to be doing today is taking this hedge out so that I can lay a concrete foundation and um, put a shed on it. But um, to be honest, I think for now I'm gonna have some lunch and um, not make any rash decisions. Well, I've got no idea where the day's gone. I, after getting home, um, I've pretty much sat on the settee all day. Did a little bit of editing, uh, but other than that, I've just watched telly and it's been lovely. Uh, and I have made a good dent in my, um, my birthday cake. Uh, but it did give me a chance to think a little bit more about what I was talking about before and how I don't plan my life around five, ten year goals. Uh, what I do is uh, aim just to carry on being happy. And to be happy, I set myself mini goals. And it's not something that I do consciously, but it's always about improving mine and my family's life and to ensure that we continue to be happy. And I think Sarah is a little bit different for me. She will plan how she's going to get to that end goal. Uh, but ultimately, we both get there and we both achieve the same thing it just in our own separate ways so based on that let's look at how we are going to achieve the end goal as far as uh, EVs standardization of them uh, some sort of standardization around charging and the infrastructure uh, we've got all these different companies all ultimately trying to achieve this, the, the same thing and that is to gain our custom to charge our EVs so does it really matter at the moment that everybody's doing something different I see that as a good thing because everybody's being really positive and with that positivity you will get a result at the end and I hope that along the way we will find the best method so you know it, it would be dull if we just at this point now said right um, I don't know CCS charging is the way forward every car is going to have that adapter and uh, every charger is going to be able to charge it what's to say there's not a better option 
I, I think at the moment it's good. It's good that we're trying all these dis different systems out. That's not to say I want that to carry on, but uh, let's find the best way. Let's use that positive investment at the moment to find the best method so that ultimately we come up with the best solution. And the best solution is the thing that works best for us as customers. So I think we just need to give them a little bit more time, uh, allow them to make those decisions and come up with different ideas because ultimately we're all gonna get there in the end. And the end goal is something that is simple and straightforward for us to use and very cost effective. And I'm sure that within the coming years, that is where we will end up. Um, so that kind of brings today's probably shorter vlog to an end, but um, having picked up the kids, I have got a lovely new bottle of gin that needs trying. Uh, so I think I'm gonna be drinking some of that tonight and uh, I know we're gonna have a nice steak dinner all together. So um, I'm gonna draw it to a close. I hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. If you have, remember to like and share it. And if you're not doing so already, subscribe to the channel and I will see you again very soon. You will take care, cheers. Cheers.